Hi guys, welcome back to another update information video. So this is kind of a mini update or like an Wild Hills Island patch thing. I don't really know what patch is. I think it's basically just a mini update and like little tweaks. So if you don't have uh, the Wild Hills Island Discord, then you wouldn't know of this. But they have done some changes to the game. Basically starting, um, I'm not entirely sure when it starts, I think it has started from today. But horses will be more reliably found at their spawn points. Right now, spawn points have a chance of spawning nothing, and it has always been this way. But they are removing this chance. Now horses will always spawn at their spawn points. However, there will be a longer respawn delay. This should make things like horse hunting on private servers more reliable. So basically you will always find a horse at the spawn point. But the respawn points, after you catch it, it may take a while for there to be a horse to spawn again. But there will be a horse there. So if you do not know where all the spawn points on all the islands are, let me know if you want me to do a video on that. But I'm pretty sure... Quite a few people have done a video on the different spawn points in on all the islands. So you can just type into the YouTube search bar spawn points for horses on Wild Horse Islands and videos should come up. So there have been like things added to the game. So there are now 11 new island unique hair colours. I do not have the um pictures of them i just have the names so on royal island they are adding cow print it matches the accessories so these accessories it will match that and i cannot wait to find it and have a whole cow print horse with all the accessories and everything i know i haven't even found one yet of the old ones but still <laughs> So, cow print they are adding to Royal Island. They have... Oh, wait, wait, sorry. The pink cow print that matches that stuff is on Mountain Island. Okay, don't get confused. And the normal cow print will be on Royal Island. So, don't get confused. I do not have the normal cow print. I only have the pink cow print, unfortunately. But I do need to get both. Um, so... That is the first two. Then we have zebra stripes, which I'm guessing is just black and white stripes. Um, will be found on Desert Island. It says it matches the accessory pattern. Um, and on Forest Island, they are adding three new horses. They are adding the pearly green, the flowery, and the pearly. So there is going to be a lot of pearly, pearly stuff adding to this game. So... This is like orange, this is pearl orange, orange pearl, whatever you want to call it. Um, this is orange pearl as well. This is red pearl. So pearly, I think, is just going to be like the colour of the pearl. I'm pretty sure it's just going to be like this colour. So they are adding those three to Forest Island. Um, Desert Island, obviously, we have the zebra stripes plus the pearly red which is like this, this dumbbell here. Oh, wrong, wrong thing, accessories. So the pearly red is this color. So they are adding that plus the zebra stripes to Desert Island. Royal Island, we know we have the cow print plus we have pearly pink. So a lot of pearl going on here. Um, Mountain Island, obviously the pink cow print plus the pearly orange so that's like all the other stuff i have i do have quite a bit of the pearly orange tack so if i do manage to catch the pearly orange hair i obviously will give it that tack um where are we next luna island they're giving the pearly blue hair um there's uh, volcano island is pearly black obviously i don't see how that's gonna be any different to all the others Blizzard Island is not having a new hair, neither is Jungle. I think that they've got too many on those islands anyway. 
So those are all the new Island Unique hairs that are joining in the game. Island Unique hair colour horses can now spawn in herds. How great is that? How great is that? So if something pops up on your screen saying there is a herd on this island, go and check it out because there might be an Island Unique hair horse in it. Horse spawn points no longer have a chance of spawning nothing. We already know that. Um, we already know the next thing. Updated the chat message that announces when a player captures a horse with a rare stat. So when you catch a horse, it usually will come up with um, this blue writing saying that, oh, this person caught a horse with a rare stat, 0 0.9, blah, 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 blah. So they're not doing that it will say the actual stat number. For example, it would say 94 over 99 or something. So, if I caught this horse, it would say like 90, uh, 62 over 71, basically, and that would be a rare horse stat. So, it will say it in here, the fraction rather than the decimal. And I think it just makes it a little bit easier for people to understand because I never understood the 0.996% thing because my math isn't mathing. Like, I'm, I'm not going to use math when I'm playing a game. Right, what is the next one? You will now earn bond occasionally when riding your horse. So just by riding around on your horse, you will be bonding with it, which I guess this is really good because... um. In real life, you do kind of bond with your horse as you ride them. So this is a really good uh, thing to add to the game. And two new accessory patterns are available at Abby's Accessories. So let, it, let us head over to Abby's Accessories now and see if they are in the shop. I don't think they will be because I don't know when this update, this patch update has gone live but i think it did go live today because on the discord it said that they have put all this information up today so i'm pretty sure it's gone up today so in case you didn't notice or you didn't know or anything um here is the update information for you the mini patch update information so we're gonna head over to abby's accessories and see if she's got any of the new ones in store and if she does, obviously we'll buy them. Also, if she has the cow print, I will buy it. Let's have a look and see what she's got. This is the zebra print. I feel like I have to get it so I have it ready for when... For when I find the zebra print. The zebra print thing. Okay, so she doesn't have the new accessories, but the new accessories are rainbow stripes and tiger stripes. The tiger stripes matches the Island Unique hair horse that you can find. I think you can find tiger stripes on uh, Jungle Island and the rainbow stripes I'm guessing is just like rainbow colours in stripes. Um, and there is an added special item indicator colour label to trade window. Um, I don't know what that means. I have no idea what that means. I think we have to trade with someone uh, to see what that means, but I have no idea. So another great thing that they have added is that the Island Unique hair color horse spawn rate, they have changed it from 0.01% to 0.01111111%. And they're not kidding. It means that before it was 1 out of 10,000 and now it's 1 out of 9,000. So that is a big difference, which means it may be a bit easier to find an Island Unique hair horse. So we may be going hunting soon for them. Just keep an eye out. But anyway, guys, that is all the information I have and all the information they have put out on this new little update. Um, let me know if you have already caught one of the new Island Unique hairs. Um, that would be crazy. Like, if you've caught one already, you are insane. Um, I hope you did enjoy this. And speaking of updates, the next update is in 10 days and it's the mystery event. So guys, comment down your predictions 
or you can email me your predictions. Um, I will link my email in the description. Um, you can either comment them, email them, or send them to me on Roblox. But comment your, give me your predictions for the mystery event. And we will see who, who gets it right. And I'll be doing a video on that too. So guys, I hope you have a good day. Or have had a good day. Because my posting times have changed during the week. I will be posting at 5pm UK time. Just because I think it's a bit easier. Because a lot of people are back at school now. Or going back to school. But on the weekends, I will still be posting at 3pm UK time. So turn those notification bells on so you don't miss an upload and hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye, everybody.